Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Um, this is actually my first video with a voiceover. First of all, I want to wish everyone a happy new year. Happy 2018 to everyone. I hope uh, everyone's doing fine and everyone had a fine New Year's Eve and Christmas and everything. Um, so, my name's Anna, uh, but you can call me Bunny as my channel username says. So I'm um, 19 years old, and I'm Mexican, and I'm an animation student. Uh, well, I'm gonna, well, while, while we see my attempt at a sketch, uh, we're gonna talk about, <laughs> about 2017. Uh, 2017 was an okay year. Half of it was really good for me and the other half was um, not that good. Um, I actually finished high school and started college in 2017, so woo me. Um, I, I am going to, well, it's literally not an animation school. It's, uh, it's more for STEM uh, careers and all those sorts of stuff. But they do have an, an art major, which is um, my major, the one that I'm studying. Uh, I'm actually already onto the line art. This, this video is sped up a lot, because it took me two hours and a half to film. Uh, well, back to 2017, I'm sorry. Um, 2017 uh, was a good year. Uh, high school was not my favorite. I did make some really good friends in high school, which I hold very dear to my heart. Uh, but I didn't really like my classes because I've always been an artsy child and I always find myself sketching during class and teachers don't really like that. Um, uh, then, uh, then I started animation school, which is honestly probably the best experience of my life. I, I love it. I'm in love with, with all my classes except for physics. But physics, not really. Well, oh yeah, I need physics, but um, that's the one class I probably don't like. Um, but yeah, uh, 2017 was okay. I hope 2018 is a lot better. Um, my resolutions for the year are well, lifestyle-wise, it's probably to be less wasteful, to try to like be more environmentally friendly and all that all that stuff you know i'm not gonna try to get skinnier or anything i probably should but i'm not yet uh, well i'm not gonna make it a resolution because then i feel guilty about it um i hope in 2018 it can be more environmentally friendly and that i can uh art wise i think i want to try to make better backgrounds because you're gonna see in this i was trying to make it resemble the old image but I'm, I'm i'm not that good at background also making more dynamic poses which of course i have uh, gotten a lot better at uh let's go on and talk about the drawing actually uh this is a remake of a really old drawing this is a drawing i made in 2013 to welcome the new year in 2014 wow i am bad at layers uh, you're gonna see a couple of times that I keep going back and forth between layers because I make a mistake and I have to to redo it in another layer. But uh, yeah, uh, well back. This uh, remake from a really, really old drawing that I made in 2013 to welcome the 2014 New Year. And there's a lot of things uh, that could be better. Let's just leave it at that. Uh, first of all, I was really ashamed of having hazel eyes because my dad has green eyes and his eyes are really pretty and I always wanted green eyes so I was really ashamed of that my eyes were just a tiny bit green instead of being all green like my dad's were so I wanted everyone in DeviantArt and Tumblr to think I had green eyes so I drew myself with green eyes but no, actually my eyes are hazel and I'm not ashamed of that anymore uh, the outfit choice. This is actually a real funny story. I used to always, I used to have a really good Batman sweatshirt, but um, I didn't want to use a Batman sweatshirt on all my like drawings, so I used to do this. This was also a characteristic drawing of me: uh, a Batman T-shirt with a long sleeve 
uh, purple and blue striped shirt underneath, which honestly I did have. I didn't have the Batman t-shirt, but I did have the striped shirt, but it was a pajama shirt, so I'm not sure why I decided it would be a good idea to make it like my, my staple. Um, but yeah, it was always like this outfit, red converse like go back on my TV and art every single drawing of me would be like that and um, but yeah I have definitely gotten better at a lot of things I've gotten a lot better at drawing and like shading and all that stuff well, of course at drawing I do practice a lot I've gotten better at coloring I mean and shading oh this is actually one of the parts I've gotten better at the hair uh, I I don't think you can see it very well on the thumbnail but uh, the my my old way of drawing hair is really uh, amateur. I used to just do lines wherever wherever I wanted. I, I actually didn't even think about the placement of the lines. I didn't think about shine anything. Nope, it was just lines. It was like drawing regular old hair. Uh, but now I have a style question mark sort of. I I really like the way I draw hair. It's probably one of the things that I like the most and that I've uh, I actually there you can see I was trying to looking for a background that looked like the original but I couldn't find any so I was doing my own uh, another thing I've definitely gotten be better at is at posing characters uh, my old characters are very stiff and they're all doing the same pose the same arm behind the back and one arm out or an arm on the hip and the other one out or both hip arms behind uh, the back it, it was really awkward and now I kind of learned to do more dynamic poses of course I did want it to resemble the original so I did put uh, her one of her arms behind her back but I promise I, I don't do that too much uh, mainly because I don't do bodies a lot anymore but I do want to try that's another resolution I want to try to draw more full body stuff and boys because I always end up just drawing girls and my male anatomy is not that good oh we're uh, on to the original and the new one goodbye everyone happy new year